popping with crack with Craig Lake. What's really good, nerd? It's your man, Theo Buller. Oh, man, y'all come on in. If you know me, grow me, share this camera. Before we begin, like, share, subscribe. If you like, leave a comment. If you don't like, leave a constructive comment. Happy Monday to y'all. Uh, shout out to the Rock With Me Nation. I'm watching a video from Country Wayne with Mike Bless and um, Miss Rolanda in it. I don't normally talk about, you know, videos like this, but, uh, you know, I, I rock with other content creators. I do. But, uh, <laughs> oh Lord. Listen, so y'all know who Country Wayne is. I'm pretty sure y'all do. If y'all don't, Country Wayne with a, with a K, not a C. Funny, funny comedian, funny comedian. So, uh, Previous video before this one, <laughs> yeah. uh, stuff like that. they were playing a game of truth or dare. Uh, Rolanda had invited one of her homegirls to come along on the uh, trip that was supposed to be a couple trip. Her and Mike. How come Wayne came down? How come Wayne came down? And why he was all looking all blushing and he was like, "You can look at me." Hey man, listen, I'm gonna pause the video real quick. I'm gonna pause the video real quick. Listen. <laughs> <laughs> and we can say this falls under uh, unapologetically heterosexual if we want to. Listen, game recognized game. I'm gonna help my sisters out because. <laughs> so previous video, they played a game of truth to dare. First of all, that's a kid game. We play truth to dare when we in our twenties. We don't play truth to dare when we in our late forties, fifties, and stuff like that. We didn't done way too much. To do. <laughs> It's, 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 we didn't done way too much stuff by then to be trying to play truth and tell. <laughs> so, Rolanda used to kick it with, with Wayne. Now she's kicking it with Mike. Wayne is kicking it with Mike's sister. They on a couple trip. Everybody smashing. <laughs> not 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 like that. Not like that. Mike and Rolanda smashing. Wayne and 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 Mike's sister smashing. So, yeah, because that other stuff would be nasty. I ain't saying, I'm just saying. <laughs> but anyway, so, uh, they played a game, Truth to Death, and, and Miss Rolanda Homegirl, ladies, ladies, you got to be careful who you who, who you call your homegirl, because a <laughs> homegirl say, who's the best lover you ever had? Now, as I said to my wife, If you have to lie, now is a perfect time to do so. And in lying, it don't need to be obvious that you're lying. This need to be the time that you're trying to win an Academy Award or at the very least be nominated for, for an Academy Award. You got your man up and the dude you used to smash or being fair, ladies. Oh, it, it's, I, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's, it's 2021 about to be 2022. Whoever it is. You got your current lover there and your previous lover there. You, you, you got to say it's your current lover. Now, watch this. I got options on the table, as I said to my wife. Because what Miss Rolanda did, she played the fifth. <laughs> <laughs> How the hell you plead the fifth? Who are you protecting in this situation? It can't be the dude that cheated on you and is now smashing your man's sister. It can't be his feelings you protecting because of your man, logically speaking, you got to be protecting Mike's feelings. Rolanda, you 50 some years of age. Now, I know they wrote this like this. Dwayne, Wayne wrote this thing like this here, but listen here, Lady, ladies, I'm saying this to y'all because I, I don't know. Some of y'all look at this stuff and because some of y'all have actually got caught up in some stuff like this. But this, you know, my PSA announcement. Listen here. <laughs> Should you find yourself in this situation, it's either you win that Academy Award by lying and saying it's your current lover. B, because you it's, just, it's another option on the table. You can hopefully it's the truth, tell the truth and say it's your current lover. Or, if you know you can't say that, see, 
That person ain't in this room. <laughs> that ain't gonna go with you well either. <laughs> with your current lover. <laughs> but it's gonna go over a whole lot better than you talking about you pleading the fifth or that it's actually your previous lover. Like, that's not gonna go over to it. Like, I, I that's lit. hey, hey, hey. And then when she asked Mike, was he fine? Was they okay? He said, yeah. <laughs> 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 Let me just go ahead and say this for the people that might not be. Listen, listen, hold on. Because <laughs> I have been this dude on both sides of the fence, really. Because I can only speak as a heterosexual male, so I'm going to speak as a when, when we ask y'all, is everything okay? And y'all say, yeah, or okay, and it's dry, we know y'all lying. <laughs> you know y'all lying. You, you, there's no way in the world you can think your man that's attentive to all your needs, attentive, attentive to your emotions, your mood swings and everything like that. This dude don't know you lying when you say, yeah, I'm fine. No, everything okay. He know you. We, we know y'all be lying. So watch this. If you know you lie. <laughs> if you know you lie, when you say it, you can't be oblivious when we say it because we really say it the same damn way y'all say it. Because <laughs> we learn from y'all. We be hoping y'all can pick up the man. We be hoping, we be hoping y'all can pick up the hint. Oh, Lord. Man, if he was in a relationship with my sister, am I a rebound? Because, you know, because last time I checked, I don't, I don't come off nobody's bench. I'm the best thing that ever happened to people that life I'm in. Okay? <laughs> I ain't no off the bitch type of cat. You know? You are. You are. I am. I am. You are today. You are today. Sex partner. Yeah. God, why is that so important? Yes. You are. Sex that's the way right now. I'm not fooling you. You're right. I'm not fooling you. You can't. You are acting just like him. We're not going to do this. I'm We're not going to get on Zoom with oh. my sister Wayne, and you're going to tell them. I'm the best sex break they haven't had. And your friend. You little messy. Are you serious? Hmm? You are serious about getting on the phone with him. <laughs> no, I ain't serious. Oh, Thank I ain't you. Sure. Thank you. You are the best. You are. <laughs> you are the best, baby. <laughs> I ain't tripping. Sure. I just have to look at him. You are the best. He tripped. Look him. Look him. Oh, uh, it's a lot of y'all ladies out here that don't think dudes will break up over you or some shit. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm trying to get my YouTube up. Listen. Listen, you the best I ever had. The whole world can know. Listen. 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 We break up over stuff. Listen, hold on. I'm trying to help you ladies out. Cause some of y'all, some listen. Listen. Where we at? Amen. We break up over stuff like that. Listen to me. Let me help y'all out. Un unapologetic and heterosexual. The country Wayne special. Yeah. The country Wayne. Mike Bless. Lana Smith. I, Cause this is funny. I, I do follow country Wayne. Let me, let me, listen here. I broke up with a female one time cause she ain't offered me no plate of food. And if she watching this video, I'm hoping she know by now. Cause she tell, she swears she don't know why. I just stopped talking to her. After taking her to a comedy show. <laughs> Buying her and her homegirl a drink, taking her to the club, taking her to the movies to see the Ungrateful Eight, and buying her a few smoothies at Tropical King, Tropical Smoothie. We, I'm talking to her on a Sunday. I, I, we ain't, we still ain't officially in no relationship, and no, I had not got the cookie. I, I, I you know, I'm a dude. You know, I play it by ear. She tell me her whole complete damn Sunday meal. She didn't put it down for the crown. She got three children, I, you know, but I was a bachelor because 
only person I was talking to was her. And since we weren't in a relationship, I was, I was still a bachelor. And I know y'all be like, well, you ain't in no relationship with her. She ain't have to feed you. You're right. Didn't have to take her to no comedy show. Didn't have to buy her and her homegirl no drink. Didn't have to t pay for her to go to no club. Did not have to take her to no movie. Did not have to, you know, buy a couple of movies, you know, buy some tropical smoothies, come drive, spend time with her while she was at her job and everything like that. St some stuff that which, you know, people today would say was simp behavior. And you know, <laughs> considering how I got treated, I can't say that they wrong when they say that. Like, that's some simp behavior. That's why y'all find out right now, ladies, because she's still single. She's still single. And this happened a while ago. And when I say a while ago, way over six years ago. Yeah, probably about eight years ago. Yeah, she's still single. Offer me no plate. You cooking. You didn't did some Jiffy cornbread mix, some uh, red Kool-Aid. She didn't say, she didn't say fruit punch. Some red Kool-Aid. <laughs> you done did some fried chicken. You done did some greens with some yellow rice. And she had dessert. <laughs> I handed it around like I don't know how many times. Like, you know, you with you. Ain't offer your boy nothing. You know what I said after that? Well, hell. I'm not asking for the cookie. If I can't get a plate of food, I know that. I, that shit. You know, I ain't saying, I'm just saying, if I, at the very least, I can't get off the meal. Oh man, this ain't gonna work. She's still single. She's an attractive looking sister. All the compliments in the world and everything like that. But I know why she's single. That's it right now. Signs, like, ladies, <laughs> It's some, it's, you know, it, it's not, being oblivious is not specific to a chromosome. Everybody can be oblivious, but I ain't saying, I'm just saying. Listen, I appreciate y'all rocking with me and everything like that. I got to come back and do another show. I, <sighs> Sports talk the way we talk, talk about the Pittsburgh Steelers. I'll be back at you in a few. Peace.